Step down a little bit so people can get out the door. Yeah, Thank you. Sure. We all hit you at the same time. Sorry about Sorry. that. Can you build any kind of momentum in one game? I think so. I know it's the start of the tournament for us, so uh, that's a positive way for us to start. And you have to, like we talked about after the Duke game, this is a new season. You know, this is a new segment of the year, and you got to kind of forget about, uh, you know, learn learn from the season, but at the same time, forget and move forward and think of this as a new opportunity. So, uh, winning your first game can start to build momentum. You can't, I can't say we're hot or anything like that, but um, it's a good first step. They made a few pushes their last one. I think they got to the under 10, and then you personally sort of took over. What was going on there? Yeah, I mean, well, they're senior senior led team. They got four seniors that play a lot of minutes. Uh, Olivia Hanlon had one of the best seasons in the ACC this year, so you knew that they were going to give it everything they have because this could end up being their last game. Uh, so we expected a run or at least some, you know, uh, upticks in intensity. So I just wanted to try to make the right play and be a little bit more aggressive. Uh, stop settling for my jump shot. I started getting in the paint and making things happen. Do you feel like you guys were able to execute your game plan? Yeah. I think so. Um, we started off with Bryce inside. Uh, you know, he didn't shoot a great percentage today compared to how he usually does. But at the same time, we wanted to establish inside because that's where we felt our advantage was. Uh, and our, we did a good job getting the boards. JP was on the boards. Uh, Isaiah and Bryce, Joel did a great job of that. And then we finally got some transition baskets too. So I think we we played the way we wanted to play. Is there a certain amount of just relief that you got this one over with today? I mean, I guess every win gives you a little relief, but uh, I don't think we were like surprised or you know like super happy. You know, we just we're just glad that we get to go advance to the next step. We get another shot at Louisville, and it's gonna be a great game. Did y'all talk much about what happened last year in the tournament? It was such a quick stay, and y'all didn't play well at all. Um, Coach didn't talk about it a lot, but I brought it up today. Um, you know, as we were coming over to the gym, that we lost the first day we played last year, and it was it was bad, and we went straight back home. And I was telling the guys like, you don't want that. Feeling, you know? I've been on a team that's made it to the finals and had a great finals game against Miami my freshman year. I've also been on a team that went home right away. I can tell you that the former is a lot more fun and exciting. Uh, so we just wanted to make sure we made a statement the first game. And, you know, you, you don't get too many opportunities in March, so you got to take advantage of every single one. Marcus, obviously you guys uh, played without Kennedy today. Just talk about how the rest of the post guys kind of stepped up there and uh, were up the aggressiveness inside. I think uh, we did a good job from that category. Joel did a good job. Usually he gets a little nervous if he has to start. He hasn't started a whole lot of games this year. Uh, I think you know his last start might have been against UCLA in the Bahamas. Or, or was it the Bahamas? Yeah, that's right. In the battle for Atlanta. So uh, he did a great job. Gave us some solid minutes and, and competed. And, you know, Jackson Simmons came in and gave us a little lift because our big man rotation was thin. So uh, you got to be proud for, for those. Thank you.